Hello, my name is Dan Chu. I'm Senior Director of Products at VMware. Today I'm going to talk to you about what is virtualization. To set the stage, virtualization is a trend that is sweeping enterprise IT. The overall environment has over 7 million servers being shipped worldwide every year. Now out of those, over 6 million of those servers are Intel Architecture x86 volume servers. Now these are getting deployed into enterprise data centers by the hundreds, by the thousands, even by the tens of thousands into large enterprises. Now these are traditional servers with single applications running on operating systems and they are sprawled out across these data centers. This leads to tremendous cost in a number of areas in terms of hardware, in terms of data center and facilities costs, in terms of operational management and maintenance costs. Now to address these overwhelming uh, pressures and costs, what Enterprise IT has found as the most compelling tool is virtualization technology. Across these millions of servers, the average utilization, the average of each of these environments, these applications, is 5 to 10 percent. These servers are barely utilized across the environment. 90 to 95 percent of their capacity isn't being used on average. So what virtualization technology does is it allows you to take advantage of that as well as um, some very fine-grained technology to run these environments side by side on a much lower number of physical servers. To illustrate that, we take these environments that could be databases, business applications, e-commerce applications, web servers, and you can take them down and consolidate them into a much smaller number of physical servers. Each of these environments now runs side by side on a single machine. And each of them is fully isolated and fully encapsulated. To show you what that means, each of these servers, what you have here, what you had in the physical environment, there's a hardware layer, there's a virtualization layer that enables all of this, and then on top of that you have each of these environments, whether they be a database or an application server or a domain controller, they all have their separate operating systems, could be Windows, could be Linux, could be Solaris. And on top of these, each of these applications run side by side. And each of these server environments has its own CPU, has its own memory, has its own uh, Ethernet NICs, has its own uh, disk. And so they run in isolation just as they would in the physical environment. Now what does this mean for an IT customer? It means that you get tremendous savings. On average, the kinds of consolidation ratios that users are seeing today uh, range on the order of 10 to 1, 15 to 1, even 20 to 1, meaning that you know, a customer today is running 800 servers or was running 800 servers in a physical environment can now consolidate that down to a, a number like 60 servers. And the benefits on that in terms of hardware, in terms of data center, the ROI is tremendous. On average, customers are finding that the return on investment they're getting is in less than three to six months. And in addition, it also completely changes how customers can provision their applications, provision their server environments. So if you take how you initiate a new service or a new application before, putting this out into your data center took a number of weeks to procure the hardware, to install the OS and patch it, then to deploy the application and configure that. Now, because all this is in software, instantiating this takes a matter of minutes.